Meanwhile, personnel of the Nigeria Police Force held a show of force exercise ahead of the state governorship election in Osho. This time, the police is warning troublemakers to stay away from the state or conduct themselves in a peaceful manner before, during, and after the exercise. Armed policemen and soldiers mounted armored personnel carriers and vans as they patrol the state to warn those who might want to curse havoc during the poll. This comes barely 24 hours before the exercise to be conducted by Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, in 3,673 polling units across the state. Sirens blare intermittently on streets while police vans conveying security operatives on election duty were sighted at different locations. There were also police choppers on standby by area surveillance in a bid to ensure adequate security of the process and the electorate. During a visit to the police headquarters in Oshun State, TVC News observed a full display of strength by the security operatives to quell any kind of violence during and after the election. Uh, 21,000 uh, police um, uh, operatives that have been deployed to perform this exercise in Oshun State, uh, coupled with uh, more than 30,000 personnel from various uh, accredited security uh, agencies, particularly those that are members of ISIS, that Interagency uh, Consultative Committee on Election Security. Uh, those are the ones we have considered uh, incorporated to this uh, election security management in Oshun State. Uh, we are done deployment to uh, the 3,753 uh, polling units and across the 30 local government councils uh, in Oshun State. <laughs> For these security agencies, the show of force is a stern warning to anyone who has it in mind to disrupt the electoral process before, during, and after the election. Ademola Lawrence, TVC News, Oshobo.